Look at yourself in the mirror. The relationships that you have, are you proud of them? The friends that you hang out with, are you proud of them? When you open up your checking account, are you proud of it? I know people in the Philippines making 40, $50,000 a month. So if you want to be rich in the pocket and rich and wealthy in life, you must understand that it starts right here. The choice is yours. That's what I learned about life. It's all about choices. And Newton's third law teaches this. And it's the law that for every action, there's an equal and opposite reaction. That for every input, there's an output in equal proportion. And when you understand this, you understand that the elites of the world do not want you to know that you are in control. You're in control of your life. You're in control of your decisions. You're in control of your actions. And when you truly understand this, it's empowering. If not, you're going to cower up in a corner like a bitch because you feel powerless because, oh, the new tells you something or oh there's a war halfway across the world and how do you know it's real why because you saw some videos just like we saw what the the fighter jet what is it called the ghost of Kiev the fighter jet that ended up being bullshit right that ended up being fake Newton's third law explains to us a very simple principle that for every action there's an equal and opposite reaction what does that mean that for everything you sow you will reap in equal proportion now what is it that we're supposed to be sowing a lot of people don't understand that the battle that we're fighting here is not a battle of a physical battle it's not a battle between men it's a battle of the mind they are after your mind if they can control your mind they can control you Descartes the famous philosopher once said I think therefore I am which tells us that we need to rewire our operating system if we want to become something else a lot of people want to win in life but they're using the same information that put them in the shithole in the first place. So the same the same mindset that you had that put you in the problems in the first place, you're trying to solve those problems with the same mindset <laughs> that gave you the problems in the first place. Do you see the paradox? A lot of you guys over the last two years, if you did not get rich over the last two years, you fucked up. You need to be asking yourself, what did I do that caused me to stay poor? Okay, a lot of you guys stayed poor because you didn't have access to the right network, because you didn't have access to the right people, because you didn't have access to the right information. Capital Club is a global decentralized entrepreneurial network focused on multiplying, creating, and preserving wealth. Today, I'm gonna to talk to you about how I became rich and how you can do the same. I wanna make something extremely, extremely clear, extremely clear and hear me out. You have the life that you have because that's the life that you chose. And I'll tell you this, it's easy to blame other people. It's easy to blame the president. It's easy to blame your parents. It's easy to blame the system. But guess what, bitch? I made it out and so can you. Why? Because I not only took action, but I assumed responsibility. And when you understand that for every action, there's an equal and opposite reaction, you get to understand and you have the privilege to understand, which most people will never have this conversation. Most people will never look at themselves in, in, in the mirror and, guess, and, say, and say, you know what? I chose this life, whether I believe it or not. Look at yourself in the mirror, the way that you look. You look like a fat slob. The relationships that you have, are you proud of them? The friends that you hang out with, are you proud of them? When you open up your checking account, are you proud of it? When you look at your portfolio and crypto, are you happy with it? Well, guess what? That's what you chose. Well, I, I come from a third world country and, and I didn't have the research. Fuck that shit, bro. We live in the internet era. There's no such thing as borders. I know motherfuckers in Nigeria, not the scammers. I know motherfuckers in Nigeria making 30, 40 grand a month. I know people in the Philippines making 40, $50,000 a month. Oh yeah, but they got lucky. They, they know something that I don't No, no, no kidding, bitch. Of course they know something that you don't know. It's obvious. The question is, what do they know that you don't know? And how do you get access to that information? Capital Club will give you access to that information. I want to make one principle extremely clear. Everyone is self-made, but only the rich will admit it. But let me say it again. Everyone is self-made, but only the rich will admit it. The poor will blame other people. Why? Because when you're poor of the mind, you will inevitably be poor of the pocket. So if you want to be rich in the pocket and rich and wealthy in life, you must understand that it starts right here. And that's what I realized. That's the principle that changes everything. The moment you're six years old, they tell you to pledge allegiance to a flag that you've never heard of, that symbols that you don't understand, that you don't know what they mean they tell you to pledge allegiance and they tell you to follow the american dream well let me tell you something about the american dream in order for you to be dreaming you must be asleep in order to be dreaming you must be asleep you know and i know a lot of you guys these concepts are new and, and trust me i've been through this journey i've been through this journey for the last three or four years but if in the last two years you've not gotten absolutely disgusted with the system that the system has been designed to destroy you designed to beat you into submission to keep you a slave then i don't know how to help you because the evidence is out there and when we say the system dude the system was created by people just like you and me that are more intelligent than you and me that realized if they don't 
don't like something, they're just gonna go out and change it. So that's why we're here, because I don't like this shit. So guess what, I'm gonna change it. Over the last two years, we've tried to devise a plan on how to become uncensorable. This is the reason why I haven't explored going public in a lot of these, these avenues, because I was vulnerable. I didn't have a network. I didn't have the connections, the resources, the power that I have today. Today, I can make two phone calls and I pretty much can do whatever the fuck I want. But two years ago, I couldn't do that. So I need to focus on myself. I need to focus on leveling up. I need to focus on becoming better. And as I become Neo of the Matrix, because that is my role, my role now is to pull people that are in three phases of life. The first phase is the come up phase. It's people that work jobs, they have their nine to five, but they understand, they fundamentally know that something is wrong. There's a 10% tax on the food that they eat. They, they ask themselves, what the fuck is going on? When they see 9.1% inflation, when they see $31 trillion in debt, something is not right here. And those people are in the come up stage. I remember being in the come up stage when I was 15, 16, 17. There's not many like you, but if you're here, you're a glitch. You've been called for something, but not all those that are called or chosen. You must choose that you uh, must be willing to go against the average norm until we change the average norm, that you have to be willing to sacrifice. The choice is yours.